What's up, everyone? Count Tim Ron here. Uh, after watching another night of uh, Lewis Potts on YouTube, I decided, you know what? He makes a lot of videos talking about this top down light where he'll point like a hard, harsh light down at a table using that reflection of the light or not reflection, but the bounce of the light to come back and hit the subject. So I decided to make a short video about it and actually ended up making a short film. And this little slight bit of BTS, I tried to use, I, I might as well use it still. I tried to use the reflector uh, to get some light and create some bounce. Did not work. I mean, it did if you look at the wall, but the TV is gone. So <laughs> it didn't work out the way I wanted it to be. And as you can see, I had this six foot tall uh, C stand. And that's from a good friend of mine. Uh, well, I didn't get it from him. But he told me that a local VFX studio, I think, out here, very popular. Uh, I think it was, I don't know if it was George Lucas Studio. No, it's not George Lucas Studio. But it was another VFX company out here in the Bay. And they got rid of some stuff. So he told me about the auction. So I went ahead and put up my bids. And both I got two large six-foot stands, C-stands. And I just gave him one. And we both went, uh, got a short one and a tall one. So collaboration. Any other time I wouldn't put this in a video, but Sony, get your act together, please, because this Creators app, and I just got my firmware update on the FX30. Thank you for that, but Creators app not working. I'm doing a Bluetooth and everything is tripping. I'm not going back in the days and olden times and plugging in a cable. It's not happening. Please, let's figure this out together. I was looking for like a grip arm, like something for the C-stand to put it overhead, that didn't work. So I ended up using the same boom that I used for my audio. And because luckily it's a small light, it ended up working. So here's a reference shot from his video where he's showing the technique and method that we're gonna use. A hard, harsh, hard lighting pointed down at the table and then the bounce from the light will reflect up. And uh, here's my attempt. Gonna hold it, I couldn't keep it, couldn't hold it in. Epidemic Sounds one who is behind the beautiful music in the background and actually every single clip besides me doing my own, you know, folly myself, straight Epidemic Sound. It's very easy, quick to use, nothing but music. Seven day trial going on, free trial. Use the link in bio. Y'all know me. Peace. Now because of the height that's touched the top of my ceiling, I could not see the intensity or the Kelvins I was at. So I have to use my phone and reference to see what uh, I had it at. Here is the first shot I had with the top down lighting and I ended up liking this. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty harsh. I kind of captured a nice little mood about being in the kitchen. Uh, but the funny thing is it was so bright that I had to go back up there to bring down an intensity anyways, which you'll see. But in this part, I'm just setting up props. And the funny thing is, I wasn't planning on making a short film. I just started throwing stuff together in, in reference. And then as you can see, I'm reaching back. <laughs> I'm reaching back off the, what do you call that? My mind's blank, sorry. It's always late when I'm editing and filming videos nowadays. Uh, but the thing that, that a dishwasher holder, a dish, we'll just say a dish holder, whatever you wanna call it. It's not a dishwasher. I'm a dishwasher. And <laughs> and this is just me setting up the props for the scene. I think my goal at this point is to see how many C-stands and uh, grip can I fit in this little old kitchen. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I had to let, who is this? James Ryan's car cook real quick, man. I, <laughs> I had to let y'all hear that beat drop. This my, I'm listening the same time as y'all. I'm like, nah, why he really going crazy with this beat right now? But as you can see, I'm having a lot of fun. <laughs> I'm having a lot of fun filming this part. 
even though when you watch the, the short, it's really kind of depressing. Like, it, let's not talk about that. I'm cool, though. Don't worry. I'm blessed. Uh, sometimes, often stressed, but he got me. God got me. Anyways, so then, boom, right? So, I'm just pretty much testing on these shots. The lights are pretty harsh. So, I ended up turning down the intensity. I think at first it was, like, around 19, but I knocked it down at 7, and that's what I liked it at. But the funny thing is, that still wasn't enough. I wanted some more diffusion. kitchen cooking all right all right for real so i ended up throwing up this diffusion i forgot to stop on this thing but as y'all seen from the last video i just uploaded with that um that's the same exact one and i used the diffuser even though it didn't work in that case but this case it definitely dropped it down but um this video is pretty quick this is one of my shortest videos thank you all for watching i appreciate every single one of y'all i love every single one of y'all have a blessed one and enjoy this short